Hi there, this is Rob Canan, former editor of Hot Rod Magazine, and I'm here at the 2013 SEMA show in Las Vegas. I want to show you some of the cool Fords that really stood out for me. Ford wanted to see what a traditional hot rod builder would do with the new Mustang, so they got a car to Hollywood Hot Rods in Burbank, California to see what they could pull off with it. Hollywood Hot Rods built this Mustang with a one-piece aluminum removable top, and they completely rebuilt the front and rear fascias in all steel. It's a pretty neat car, and we dig it. Without a doubt, my favorite paint scheme on any performance Ford is the blue and orange of the golf racing livery from the 60s. You can see it here on this Focus ST built by Universal Technical Institute in Phoenix. What really sets this car apart are the fender flares and the wider road race style wheels. Kind of a rally car for the street. It's really cool. One of Ford's biggest announcements at SEMA this year is the new Transit Connect van. This one you see behind me was designed in conjunction with Hot Wheels and Ice 9 in Detroit. This is actually going to be a Hot Wheels car that you can buy in the little miniature scale. This car has been widened about six inches in the back, four inches in the front, has distinctive wheels, totally distinctive color and bodywork, big TV screen, and little Hot Wheels drawers with cars in them, and even a track in the back. Get a big one for the folks and a little one for the kids. Classic Mustang enthusiasts now have a chance to build a brand new 67 Mustang Fastback with a new all-steel body from Dynacorn, licensed through Ford. This car, built by Classic Recreations, uses also a new Ford Mustang GT 5-liter engine, transmission, with a lot of new suspension parts, painted bright red, and has a really good smelling black leather interior. We found the 65 Galaxy here, built by Kindig Designs. It's a Ford Design Award winner, and it blends a lot of 60s traditional style with modern parts and modern takes on the 60s style. Like the engine is a newer Ford, Ford modular motor, made to look like an old 60s Ford race motor. The interior has 60s style influences but with a modern flair and it's got custom wheels on it that are much wider than they had in the 60s, much more modern, and a racing stripe similar to the 60s but with a modern take. One of the biggest trends of the 90s was a sport truck where people would take a new two-wheel drive pickup, lower it, put bigger wheels and tires on it, kind of clean up the appearance a little bit and make it their own. And this F-150 Super Crew concept is kind of the modern sport truck. And that was a look at just some of the Ford vehicles here at SEMA. Come back to Ford Social if you want to know more.